afternoon, everyone. My name is Irene Hamangawa. I'm here to present uh, the basic tools in, that we use in plumbing, domestic plumbing. As you have seen, these are the tools that we use in plumbing. Okay? These tools have got different names and different uses. For example, I'll start with it. a married hammer. This is a married hammer. This hammer is used to when you are fixing towels. Okay? You don't just hit very hard, but it's very soft not to break the towels. Okay? We've got a ballpoint. Uh, we've got a ballpoint hammer. Okay? This one, it's this is metal. Okay? So, we use it for nails. We use it for nails. Make sure that what you what you are putting it on board is supposed to be uh, tight. Okay? Yes. So, as you have seen, this uh, behind me, the, 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 there's another board that is that is displaying the hand wash basin. The hand wash basin. So we were using a spirit level to make sure that this hand wash basin is. Centered. This hand wash basin is centered. It's not moving. It's not shaking. So it's, it's supposed to be centered in all angles. And then this this side, we are displaying our kitchen sink. This is kitchen sink, formula known as kitchen sink. But it's kitchen sink. This we also use the 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 spirit level for us to. To, to regulate, not not to, not the sink to slide, okay? Not the sink to slide. We make sure we use the spirit level and the quality type of tools that we need to use. Let's not just use anyhow, anyhow tools, okay? Uh, we'll come back. This is a bathtub, okay? This is a bathtub. As you have seen, you when you are bathing, you have to be very very comfortable in bathing. So when you're storing this thing. Don't just get any tool to install a bathtub. For instance, you get this ballpoint hammer to, 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 to install this bathtub. I mean, it's going to break. Okay. okay. What, what other tools do you have for? Uh, yeah, we have. Um, we have. Um, this is a pipe wrench to tie in tiny pipes. As you, as you had seen, that side we were installing. Um, a kitchen sink so which needs us to use a pipe wrench for us to tie those pipes that are underneath okay we have a shifting spanner okay which does the same it also ties okay we have the uh, we have this um axo okay axo and axo blades the whole the whole tool okay we this one is used to cut pipes, okay? It's used to cut pipes as well as this. This one is used to cut metallic pipes. This one is used to cut plastic pipes, okay? Now, when you used to cut, when you, you've cut with using this, this axle, when you see that the pipe has got, it's, it's too rough, okay? What do we do? We come to the file, we get this round file, we make sure we file all the rough edge that is on the on the pipe to make sure it is smooth and be nice okay so you see how plumbing is very interesting we do everything neatly don't just do things anyhow yes um i have seen another different tool i don't know if you you also use it in plumbing uh the one in the orange the one in orange yes this one yes Okay. What is it point? Okay. This is a pop rivet set. Okay. Okay. Yes, it's got uh, their own rivets, though we didn't display the rivets that we used to put. Actually, when you just open it like this, I wish I had I had it on my hand so that I can demonstrate how it works. Okay. Yes. So we've got our own rivets that we install in here and then when you want to or you want to make the sheets 
I'll say in plumbing we've got sheet, sheet metal. So when you are spreading the sheet, when you are hitting it like that, the, the rivet remains to the to the board where you are. You want it to stick. In, okay. in short, you are saying the pop rivets used in the sheet metal to to make joints. Yes. Okay. Yes. I can see something like a scissors. Is it a scissors or what? Is it a scissors or what? This one. Yes. This is a tilt snip. Okay. okay. Yeah. This one is used for cutting the sheet metal. We have seen we when we cut using this mm -hmm. this uh, this tilt snip, we also when we want to join them, we use the rivet. Oh. Okay. Yes. All right. Yes. Uh, something I am able to see is uh, uh, something like this one with the handle on top. Yeah. Watch this. Okay, this one is a pipe vise. All right. Okay, it's a pipe vise. Okay, we put our pipes here. If one pipe, we put a pipe here, and then when we want to, this this will, will turn to hold the pipe okay. when you when you put it there, mm -hmm. and then when it holds, you we use the the, the, the this one. Okay. We, when we want to make threads, okay. okay. When we want to make threads, we use the whole lot of this to make it, the threads that we see uh, in the pipes. Okay. Yeah. And then we cut using this this tool. Now, what's the difference between this cutting tool and another cutting piece I saw that, right? Yeah. The one. Is the tool. 